how are you? I just took my matzahs out of the refrigerator and um, I wanted to show you how to make the perfect matzo ball. Um, it's nice and firm right now. I have my water on the stove and I brought to a rapid boil. And the trick of making these babies and making them perfect is to uh, add a little oil to your hands. And I just did. So I have a perfect ball right there and I'm gonna drop them into my water. But just to give you an idea, we wanna just add a drop of oil. And that's the trick here. Nice and greasy, but not, nice and oily, I should say, but not too oily, okay? So again, you're gonna grab about one tablespoon to two. Remember, these are gonna double or even triple in size. And you just wanna go lightly around the edges and you don't wanna press. And you wanna drop them into your boiling water, which I drop down now. We're gonna simmer these bad boys for about 20 to 30 minutes, okay? And they are heavily salted, um, heavily salted water. And I wanna show you the water in a minute. And again, I just add a little oil to my hands. And we just grab a little matzah. Again, one tablespoon or two. And we're just gonna lightly roll it. And that's it. And we're gonna get perfect round balls going right around the edge. And that's it. Okay, and again, we're gonna drop these into our water. Oop. Sometime I get a little Italian there <laughs> doing the meatball, but this is not a meatball, this is a matzo ball. Okay, oh, and we don't wanna play with it too much. Look at I played with it too much and it got a little weird. So that's not good. I'm gonna do it again. Grabbing that. And we wanna go just lightly, just around the edges. And that's it. Roll in those edges. And we're done. Don't play too much with it. You'll have a perfect matzo ball. And then right into our salted water for 20 to 30 minutes, okay? Hold on. And here we go. Okay, so this water was rapidly boiling. I dropped it too low and I'm just gonna simmer. And then the lid's gonna go on for 20 minutes, okay? So I'm gonna my matzo balls and I will be back.